it is us the normies back to watch more of Batman the Animated Series. This is part two of The Cat and the Claw. Yeah. Apologies again. Yeah. It's last oh week's <laughs> reaction that all of us are not here. One of us caught COVID-19 surge and we are just taking our precautions. We're being safe. We're all feeling good though and we're all taking our precautions. Just, we all took tests. We all took tests. We're just quarantining right now and making sure things are safe. And you guys should do the same as well too. Remember, masks wash are the ass. best thing out there. And <laughs> it's your worse than ever right now. Ass. In washing America. your hand and washing your ass is a very big thing in today. I'm telling you, it, it'll go a long ways if you continue to do that. It might help me get some ladies and uh-huh. girls. It might help me get some men. But anyway, too. tell them why we're on our phones. We're like, on our phones because we're communicating with each other. We're on Discord. <laughs> we're talking to each other. That's how we're rolling. All right. And last announcement. I know there's a lot of announcements. I'm so sorry, guys. But remember, this is not a market substitute. No. For the, what? No, it's not a uh, market substitute. <laughs> Too. You messed me up, man. You <laughs> told me not to do it right now or something like that. Okay, no. remember, this is not a market substitute for the actual <laughs> Batman the Animated Series. Please support the OG content on Amazon. Then come here and watch it with us. If you want to jump ahead, please check out our Patreon. We are a bunch of episodes ahead. Our uncuts are on there as well. Mm-hmm. If you can't do any of that, please comment, like, and subscribe. There's a bell right there for notifications. Mm-hmm. Tell us how you felt in the comment box, man. It helps out. Trust me. It Tell does. us what you think about the claw. I, did, I I did not I completely forgot about the red claw it's kind of crazy I, th- I thought it was like you know <laughs> Catwoman and her claws they do it all the time Selena Kyle also had gadgets that were shaped like little cats so there yeah, there's gotta be like a brand cons- there's gotta be a brand this. consultant in, in Gotham Oh, oh shit. You think you're so cool. Never try the Facts, 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 facts. <laughs> Cat and Claw Part 2? So home alone ish. <laughs> Batman got that intel. Uh-huh. <laughs> and just like that, he's gone. Blasted feds and their secrets. They armed with teeth. Hardcore. They never said anything about guard no plague. Want to steal a kind of germs anyway. L O L. How the fuck are they writing that? Holy shit! That whoa! That is a bold Here shot. Here we go. This is intricate. That guy gave no fucks. There we go. Oh, say it's oh my god. god! Okay, that was a smoke bomb. That oh, wow. Why would they make it look like an actual grenade? Oh my god, I'm pretty sure the door is open. Come on. What if they confuse the grenades with smoke bombs? I know we say this time and time again, but the music is just like incredible. It's like, shit. It's like the actions are, the, how the music, the crescendo drops, and it's like, a, oh man, it's so good. Like, all the story is kind of told through the music, almost. Dun, dun. Dude, that's so dangerous. Like, that's a plague, bro. What do you do? Just leave it in the box. It has, like, a generic, like, generic danger sticker on it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, your skull and crossbones. They should have left it it's in the dar- box. It's a jar of danger. Seriously, oh, no, no, Batman. No, no, no. Yeah, there you go. Hey, yeah, that's our boy! <laughs> We're like, yeah, equality. <laughs> Don't do it, Red, uh, 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 um, Red Claw. Call my bluff. But wow. Oh, she got him by a balls. Bro, isn't this kind of like, nah, it's not. I keep thinking it's a plot to one of the movies. This dude's pulling out phones. <laughs> I just noticed that. <laughs> He's like, damn, what's up, cool. girl? <laughs> Actually, you know who I could see playing a really good Selena Kyle? Mm-hmm. Catherine Winnick. 
maybe. Yeah, but if she if she didn't have her accent, she's nice. so her accent is really really harsh. Maybe Black I think the accent would make it sexy. I can see that. If she looks just like Catherine Winnick right now. Honestly, the chick who plays fucking Harley could have been on Catwoman. Alright, you guys have used that joke like <laughs> three card, times. Wrong time. Man, this is the wrong card to fuck with, dude. Oh my god. Oh, Bruce! Damn, man. Ruining the ride, bro. Come on, now. You wanna know how I know this is in the future? Cops aren't chasing him, they don't, and he's not worried about his license in the future. Let's get the next one. Oh my god! Oh my god! Uh, he played chicken with him. You lost. Bruce don't play. Bye! Holy sh- that's death. What a Paris grant. Look at him. Look at that ride. Good gorsh. Hmm. Bruce, you ain't gonna ask for Nightcap? He knows who she is now. He has to. If he wasn't Batman and he was just like, yeah, that's normal for a date. We can keep seeing each other. Like, that, that's ultimate simp shit right there. <laughs> mm hmm Girl, you need to go home. <laughs> there, finally, he's piecing it together. Leave Maeve alone. Man, what'd she do? Oh, oh yeah! yeah! You can do this! Oh, fuck so long. Hey, man, the music is just like, you know. Get out, get out, get out! Oh. 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 He was not the slapper. <laughs> there we go. Batman's in the punch right now. That's great. And she won't be able to tell Catwoman that she's. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm I'm sure she knows what that, who that fuck that was. Oh wait. There we go. She knows, man. Oh, never mind. We knew. I'm just dumbass. <laughs> Batman's like Psh. the great mountain lion. Of the mountain, right. the mountains. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what, what the fuck? That guy's getting mauled right now. Yeah, see how I went over the moon. <laughs> Red claw. There it is. Oh my god. Oh dear. <laughs> Come on. Like They're that. Batman Cowman. They can't. Damn. They're thinking ahead back in the day, bro. Oh no! That's just a genius ah! there. Also, I just realized they're trying to release a deadly virus, and that's like very uh, the fuck uh, <laughs> relevant right now, I guess. That dude's an asshole. Yes! Oh my I'm god! Well, how's he gonna stop that? What do you got? An acid antidote? Flexing bus out of here. 
Get the fuck out! Oh, they're not gonna do any. Okay. Is he gonna kiss her? What the fuck is that? Oh my god. That'll do it. Is blowing up the like the, the plate gonna make it better? I mean it'll it, I don't know. I mean man. burning it down. They should guess, eradicate yeah. it. I would think that's probably the best thing they can do. Oh my god. Maybe? If only know. Batman had saved us Burn from coronavirus. I guess. Right? Like I don't know if this shit works. Damn! This guy. Let's go Duke Nukem in here, bro. Holy shit. That's smart. I mean, uh, those are uh, smart play. Yeah, you're, you're, Seems yeah, like a suicide it. mission, but. Holy fuck, oh. bro. How far will that shit get? Yeah. Dragging fire. Holy shit. Dude, <laughs> oh my you, you just killed the red, the red claw? There we go. Bitch. That's a lot of damage. <laughs> oh. oh, shit. Red claw. I won't come to the enemies. You Pussycat. Actually, Catherine Winnick would probably make a better red claw. You will learn why everyone Uh-uh. Uh-uh, sweet revenge, please. Ah, the oh, man. shit. She got clawed herself. Thank you, friend. Now, if this wasn't a kid's show, that would have been a very graphic death. Something for you to remember me by. Is that, and that's over between them? Mm. <laughs> Damn. Oh, she likes him. Ah. Are those bat cups? Yeah. <laughs> Bruce. I only love the law, babe. Damn. <laughs> oh, so oh man. Hey man, Batman, so dude, he just He's like more than you'll ever know. <laughs> he, he, he just be doing some some bitch shit sometimes, man. Like he, he had to lock he's her a, up, bro. He could have let her go. You know what I mean? He could have let her he's go. Anti, he's a he's an anti simp. Yeah, he definitely is, bro. He's like, nope. <laughs> she, it could be the hot. No. It could be his wife, dude. But like, but she, he he, did, he treated her well. He did he did treat her differently than other criminals. Yes, he I'm did. Married. He did. I'm he, married to the law. He, he protected her. He made sure you know all these things that. Uh, so, I'm so sorry, Miss Rose. Oh yeah, but yeah, he uh, he he did he. He could have let her go, man. But then I get it, man. That's his code. You know what I mean? Like he, every bad guy has to go. Like he just—he was all like, "I like you" and all this shit. He got all googly eyed. He got it all blushy and shit. And yeah, then like, so but then you saw his heart break a little bit when you find out that like he found out. Oh shit! Wait, she's Catwoman. Like he figured it out. And he yeah, was like, he's yeah. like, oh shit. You know, some would yeah. say he's a vigilante just like her, though. But she's not a vigilante. She's stealing shit for herself. He's not out there stealing things. Like, Batman is selfless in that aspect. Like most vigilantes, or like like Selena Kyle, she let would have left that uh, virus go off. But Batman's like, nah, fuck that. I gotta go stop this shit. And he went in there and he and he stopped it. That's what Batman does. Batman is for the people. You understand? Batman does what Batman has to do to save the fucking mm, Batman save. Is what Batman has to do. Hey, he does what he has to do to make sure that everybody's okay and safe in Gotham. And you gotta appreciate that. The man puts in a lot of hours. Damn it. I'm just saying, facts, like facts, facts. Um, again, a lot of details. Was she? They put back cuffs on her. Yeah, he put back cuffs on her, man. <laughs> and, and, her, and, her on brand. Yeah. and her door, like her keyhole, was a cat shape. It was so cool. I just like, love the little things they try to do here. It's really. Oh awesome. man. Um, I love how uh, Red Claw went down, though. I think it was sweet revenge for even trying to, you know, the wildlife and put them in like that and use them like that. So, so that was really cool. So a couple of, uh, I felt like these were rather kind of a little bit adult themes. You know what I mean? That went overhead. Uh, government transporting diseases, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like mm -hmm. biological weapons, you know what I mean? And terrorist organizations stealing those biological weapons that went down in this episode. All right. Yeah, yeah. Um, we saw the corporate entities that uh, taking over uh, uh, a public res a wildlife resort, like they do in the real world. That should be happening. Right. Yeah. And then we we also see the 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 
the the shady backgrounds of some of these corporate entities that could be working with criminal organizations like Red Claw over here trying to kill you know shit. Mm-hmm. So yeah, yeah, yeah. it's it they're out pretty, there, bro. It felt really relatable in a way, you know, here and there. Yeah, I'm with him. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just saying it felt like it was like you know like it's just very adult themes in a tr- children. Not is that it's definitely not a children's cat cartoon, but like. For a fact, when I was a kid, all that shit over my head. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, completely. And, uh, I don't know if you guys have ever seen a movie from back in the day called Broken Arrow. No. Never seen oh, it? Oh, I think I have. With Christian Slater in it. And it's basically, I think, I think John Travolta's so. in it too, if I'm correct. I don't think I remember. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. But, but, uh, I don't, it, I don't basically, about they're on a train, and this train is, uh, is, is, uh, what do you call it again? It's, um... If I'm, I, I forget. I'm again, but this train is transporting a nuke, and then like this John Travolta's group is basically trying to steal that nuke or whatever from the yeah, train. Yeah, and that's what that yeah, little, I remember that's that, what that yeah. little scene reminded me of. Like you know, there's like there's a lot of scenes like on the train like that though. Yeah, I mean, but like, you know, still, I mean, there, there, you know. there's also there's also The Rock with the, Nick Cage and Sean yeah, Connery. But that's that's completely different. R.I.P. Sean. Oh no, yeah, that it's not different. It's just it, but that yeah, they dealt with the gas, VX gas. But yeah, that was a cool scene. Like it felt like like real life movies. That whole train scene, cutting them off, and you know all that stuff. It, that was, yeah, bro. They, they do a lot of realistic, you know, aspects. They, I like it. They went all out, and uh, I really really appreciate Gordon being like, oh shit, I already know you. We would have had it all ready for us to go. Mm. We just come here to just clean you up, clean it up. So yep. Yeah, it was a good episode, man. A lot of good action. A lot of uh, oh, uh, I'm I'm really impressed with the uh, the music. The music oh, is yeah. just it, it it's like in the background. I mean, it's it's good enough that you definitely notice it, but it's just like uh, when the action goes down, there's no dialogue, so you're really just uh, you're, you're seeing the visual action, but it's like accentuated by the music. So like yeah. the, yes, the the, the 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 story is almost told through the music. It's really it's really fucking good. It's. Yeah, man, it's just, again, it, it, it reminds me of those old Tom and Jerry, like, you know, don't we, you know, uh, yeah. Bugs Bunny, but, like, with Batman, and they just do yeah, a little, Bunny, yeah. Batman. More, and they do a very more. epic job with it. Yeah. I'm, the boys would have loved this episode. I feel like Mikey, and so especially, would have liked this. Mikey, yeah. Mikey, oh, especially. Yeah. He would have loved Red Claw. Yeah. He yeah. would have had a lot of things to say about Red Claw. <laughs> you, about, you know? Hey, man. Well, we'll uh, catch them next week when it, they come back. Yeah, it yeah, was kind of fucked up how we'll the get fucking, their thoughts next time. It was kind of fucked up how like she threw that tiger on Red Claw. She was like, "Go take care of Mount Lion." No, that he wanted to do it himself. The tiger. She, it was his own, her own revenge. And I like, oh, the the the, uh, the line Bama says like, "I'm an equal crime fighter." Kind equal, of thing. I'm an equal opportunity crime fighter. Yeah, that was dope. Man, Batman <laughs> out here just being about equal opportunity because Batman was surprised when she found out it was a girl. Like, You're a I know. Girl. I was like, "Come on, Batman!" But then he redeemed himself within the first second. Batman, like, okay, bro. Okay, okay. Batman. But Batman was way ahead of his time for anybody else. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> he really, really was. Bruce Wayne all the way. 2020. Yeah. Um, but yeah. Anything else? No, those are my things. I can't wait for the boys to be back to, and uh, to hear your thoughts. What do you guys think of Catwoman? Who is your Catwoman? I want to know. All right, y'all. We love you guys. See you guys next time. Bye. Peace. Thank you all so much for watching this week's episode of Batman. We'd like to give a special shout out to our super patrons, exploring Dylan, Ruby, Aaron, Joe Mike, Sorry, Mike Fan, and Mr. Momus. Thanks again, and have an awesome day.